Whoa, whoa, Havoc here. Alright, so today's episode, I'm um, gonna go over some stuff I did over on Discord. Uh, in case you couldn't tell, got a new paint job. So, over in the Discord chat, there's a link to a picture. Wait, why am I even talking about that? That picture looks like this. Obviously higher quality, because the import tool doesn't do 100% justice. But, uh, yeah, so that's the color scheme I went with. That's the logo for the company. So yeah, so I went through, painted quite a bit of the ship, two-toned it. Got a bunch of lights on it. Um, yeah. I think overall it's looking pretty good. I like the T I got on the side here. Just another one on the flight deck. Seems like uh, something Mr. Torque would do is uh, embellish his name and his company name all over his own ship. So, yeah, good times. Okay, so this bad boy. Well, let's give it a dock and see what happens. So, lock is off, rotating. Move into position while it's doing that. Okay, there it is. Whoa, we're not even close on the lateral. Okay, we're on bottom now. Definitely need a few more lateral thrusters. I liked how our weight just shot us right past that connection. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. All right, so let's get in here. Uh, here. Cargo, uh, Bravo, sure. Ice. Four and a half million ice. That, that's that's all right. <laughs> all right, let's go take this back. Uh, disengaging lock. This thing is just massive. I need about, I'm going to guess four more gyros. Turn the hydrogens off. Turn them back on when we get closer to base. There's no lateral thrust on this thing whatsoever. I think there's, what, one atmospheric and one hydrogen for lateral? Yeah, that's why we're sliding. Oh, wrong button. Turn my dampeners off for a second there by mistake. We want to go this way. Don't really want to increase speed. I just want to kill my lateral speed. Alright, let's go let's do it this way. The super sketchy way. Okay. So, we need to get into space. I need platinum. I'd like to get to the azimuth thrusters that require a lot of platinum, so... Coming in hot, need to peel off, burn off some of that speed. 
There it is. Just gotta stall it out. Oh, I don't have the gyro for that. Why did I do that? And why did that open? Ugh, that was terrifying. Okay. The stalling out was good, but I just didn't have the gyro to utilize that maneuver properly. So, downward deceleration. Okay, this time. Okay. Right. So, our goal is to get this guy docked and have this ice being processed here where we have better facilities for processing ice. We have those giant O2H2 generators with yield mods. Let's turn that camera around. Come on, slide over, buddy. I don't think I'm going to use that one, not that one. I didn't realize it. Oh, please clear that, Bob. Thank you. <laughs> That's not going to work, is it? Because we are landing gear set up. Lock is off still, so let's go ahead and deploy. Yeah, that's not going to work. I'm going to work close enough. Oh, no. Those feet are not even touching. One second it can connect and the next second it don't. Oh, that was a slight tap of the, of the throttle. That was crazy. All right, so inventory, cargo, ice. Now I want to disconnect again. Set the front down, come on. Okay. Terrifying. All right, let's go check on our industry. So we have to make that final connection back, right? Yes. Shift P. There we go. So now these guys should be pumping through that ice. Yes. They're evenly distributed. And hydrogen will be flowing. Alright. Yeah, buddy. When we get enough of that hydrogen running, then we can uh, head to orbit. It's going to be the big Achilles heel of this guy. So I wonder if I should half block up the feed on him. 
to make that a more accessible. Meh. So frustrating. Should I try just using that one? Yeah, let's give that a go. See how that turns out. Hopefully better. Lowering proboscis. Does that feel weird? No, oh, because it does. Alright, let's put it on the deck and go see about moving that connector. Let's move it forward three blocks to there. Uh, all right. Nothing in there. Okay. Thanks, little dude. All right. So bye. Derp. There we go. Use the stairs, Havoc. Come on. Should go one more, huh? One more and then extend that out. Yeah, probably. I like that better. Okay. Oh, come on now. So yeah, I installed the paint ball, paint mod, mo oh, words, the paint mod has been installed. So hopefully to some avail, it will work and I will like it and it'll stay. So far, I don't, but I'm gonna give it some time. I don't want to be too hasty and just judge it and and it actually is better than what I thought. Because right now it's not. I was having just as actually easier time painting with the vanilla painting mechanics. But again, I want to give it some time. So I can adapt to it and learn this quality of life mod and quality of life mods are well they increase your quality of life sometimes hastily judging something like that can be missing something that I'm not aware of all right let's get this boy parked Oh, prompt button. Whoa, oh, oh. whoa. Where are we at? Left to right. Can't tell. All right, there it is. Docked. How do it look room wise? Way better than we were, because that was sitting on top of the bomb, so. Alright, I'm okay with that. That'll work. How's the front look? Could you use a block or two longer? That's fine. 
Okay, well, let's go get a stop off and recharge us. And we need to go get our other ship and get it back to base as well. We go into the wild blue yonder. Uh, that was close. All right. It just wasn't gaining altitude. That was just weird. I had to take my hand off the gas entirely. So we don't got parachutes for this guy, so we have to be careful. I'm referring to my own personal suit. Yeah, there we go. Wonder how big of a hole we are making underneath there. And we should be filled back up by now. Oh, about half. And I updated the paint job on this guy as well, so. Alright. And we're off. Probably utilize parachutes again. <laughs> It just, it's nicer because we can just full burn accelerate and then out of nowhere just stop. See, I like this color scheme a little bit better. Got some touch up to do. A couple of spots I don't like, but overall, I like it. And we're stopped. Yeah, that's <laughs> far faster. Let me do something like this. Extreme re-entry. So I had an idea of making each one of my ships named after one of the Borderlands weapons platforms. So yeah, something that might actually happen, just give a, a theme to them all. But the funny thing is, is yeah, I need weapons on that because yeah, that just doesn't fit. Go ahead and park you back over here in this corner. Too much. That'll do. All right. So everything's back home. Now I just gotta wait for all these tanks to fill up. I should put some of these in stockpile actually. That's going pretty fast. Wow. Alright, so next episode, we're going to orbit. I think the ship's doing well. It's not, actually. Hold on. I need to make an upgrade.
That's not gonna fit how I want that, is it? I don't think so. G. Gyro. Well, that'll get us the four more I wanted. Guess we'll put four more on the other side. All right. What are you doing in here? All right. Ocho. Right. That's definitely stepping the game up a bit. All right. Well, like I said, tune in next episode. We're gonna try for orbit and see what we can accomplish out there. We're gonna go and try to get some platinum. Some uranium would be fabulous, and. Uh, I'm going to take it from there. Something I need to check into before we do any of that shenanigans. Okay, we do have an ore detector. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.